Welcome back to Earthbound. So last time we beat a, a barf monster thing, and then I was like, okay, well, I need to end this recording session, so I'll go back to town. And on the way back, um, someone learned something. Let's see, was it Ness? I don't think it was Ness. I'm pretty sure it was Paula. Yeah, Paula learned PSI Fire Beta. It, oh, oh, I didn't even realize that it told you uh, about the amount of points that it would inflict. Wow. Dang. Okay, but yeah, uh, Paula learned PSI Fire, and I thought someone else learned something else. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm completely wrong. Okay, so uh, you will see that Ness is possessed right now because uh, on the way back here, I encountered one of those ghost guys and they sent a mini ghost after me, which uh, possessed us. Yeah, uh, to heal that, we, we have to get to a town and get to a hospital. Hello. You must have had a long, tough road ahead of you, do you not? No, there is no need to explain. I already know. You must be hungry. This is good timing for you. I happen to be carrying something to eat. What would you like? Oh, wow. This is good stuff to have. Uh, guess I'll take a croissant. Yeah, Paula can have that. And a calorie stick. And uh, maybe a cup of coffee. Yeah, Paula can carry everything. There's a village of interesting people just ahead. Go there and take a good rest. I have heard the name of this village is Saturn Valley, but it cannot be found on any map. I enjoy helping those. Who, uh, I enjoy helping those who are in trouble, though I charge them for my trouble. Okay, well, at least he's here. <gasps> Butterfly. Now, this is great because I actually did need to heal everyone on the way here. Unfortunately, you cannot get rid of possession with healing. You have to go to a, a hospital to get exercise. I see you little bugs. The red ant and it's... Okay. So, red ants and black ants. Well, I may as, you, I may as well use uh, Aegis. Uh, I guess you can do, like, fire to the back row. You can just shoot one of the antoids. No! Right. So that's what possession does, by the way. It attacks your party members occasionally. And sometimes it may solidify them. Causing you to be unable to attack for that turn. All right, so, uh, yeah, this, ugh. This ghost is gonna be, uh, a problem, to say the least, until we get to the next town. Oh, Ness leveled up. That's good. But yeah, we need to get the, that next town quick. Stupid ghost. I would have gone back and just healed this, but, man, that, that, tunnel is long, and I got possessed like right near the end. Dang it. All of them. Great. Cool. Oh, broken can Bo broken spray can. Dang. That'll be good for Jeff to repair. Alright, so we just need to get through this place without dying which is easier said than done because the enemies here can be a little difficult. Oh, wait a minute. Is this is this where we need to go? Great. A little bug. Oh, a violent a violent roach. Gross. Yo, Jeff leveled up. Sweet. Um, 
Is this the one where we need to go? Oh, no. This is just an extra room. Ooh, bottle rocket. Cool. Okay, so I... I do not remember if this is correct, but I believe Jeff is the only one that can use bottle rockets. I cannot remember, honestly. I feel like that's correct, though. Whoa. Well, we're here. This is some music. Hello, what are you? We feel groove. Hi ho, me, Mr. Saturn. This place all are Mr. Saturn. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Once upon a time, we were many, many. Every day slowly are less, less. Why? Hmm? Boing. So, this is just a place filled with these little things. Mr. Saturn's. Rust promoter. Ooh, that could be good. If we can find anything that is that can rust easily. Hello? You're in a trash can, dude. I'm Dr. Saturn Zoom. And I can repair your body. Boing. Do you want me to operate on you? Ding. You are all fixed up. Okay, so we're no longer possessed. Sweet. So yeah, uh, that basically serves as the hospital, and it's free, which is awesome. So you can actually train here for a little bit, outside the village, if you want. What do you say? Do you want to slumber? Kill. Sweet, and that serves as the hospital. So now we're all healed up. Yes. And that's free too, which is most excellent. And it even has a phone in there so you can save, which is also awesome. I believe I talked to that one already. So apparently this place used to be filled with Mr. Saturn, but they're slowly disappearing. Protractor. I still feel like those are useless. Sudden Guts Pill. Ooh, that's good. I believe that's for, like, in battles only? Well, let's see here. There's Broken Spray Can. Right, I should probably give that to Jeff, too. Like, the other spray can that was broken. Does Ness have it? Yeah. But we're all filled up on stuff. Great. <laughs> oh, I still have the pack of bubble gum. I need to put that away. Okay, uh, I guess pizza place or the, the delivery place can come here and get it. Escargo Express. Hello. Hello, this is Escargo Express. Same thing as usual. All right, so for now, you can take... Pack a pack of bubble gum. I don't think I need the bad key machine anymore. I'll just get it back if I need it again. And I think that's it, honestly. Bye. All right. So also in this place, this. Saturn Valley. Oh, wow, there's lots of them. We look like same. I give you a special thing. Not now, Zoom. I give you on the way back, boing. Bye later. Later, dude. Hello. So, boing, you have $380. We trade secret error. So, boing, you have 17 $1780. We trade Horn of Life. Uh, I'm not sure what any of that is, but okay. Hello, friend. Face. 
secret. Base beyond grapefruit balls. Password, I tell. Belchman say, say password. Then stand still, wait for three minutes. Three minutes? That's a long time, dude. Hello? Base, secret. Base, behind grapefruit balls. Password, I Wait, this is the same thing that the other guy did, said. Scary, scary guy, boing. Grapefruit falls. Scary, sick, barfy. Go and la la la. Thing, scary. Man, these guys are just weirdos. I like them. in this house oh 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 this is the store hi 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 you come buying you can sell too i'm mr saturn boing can do all for you what do you want zoom let's buy stuff uh peanut cheese bar hmm okay so the uh, Horn of Life and the Secret Herb. I cannot remember what they do. Alright, so uh, the picture postcard reminds me of something that I should have talked about a while ago. Uh, a few episodes, uh, Ness got homesick, and uh, that basically keeps you from attacking some turns. Some turns you may not be able to attack at all. And uh, the way to heal that, I never explained this, but uh, the way to heal that is to either call mom and just talk to her, and that'll cure you. You can also talk to her in person, but you can also go to your sanctuary. Any your sanctuary location will heal homesickness, which is good. <laughs> Anyways, uh, oh, this is the automatic teller machine. This is an ATM. Holy jeez. Wow, that's a lot. Let's take out a couple hundred. Let's see what you have. Hi, hi, hi. You come buying. Oh, you come buying. You can sell too. I'm Mr. Saturn Boing. Can you offer you? What you buying, Zoom? Oh, the bionic slingshot. But the slingshot misses so much. Like... Uh, I don't think it's worth it, honestly. But the Great Charm... Great Charm is good for Ness and Jeff, and the Silver Bracelet is good for Ness and Paula. But the Red Ribbon is only good for Paula, so... Hmm... Okay, I'll have to do some inventory management. I think I'm just gonna sell, uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna sell the protractor. No, I'm pretty sure I don't need it. Yeah, the protractor really does nothing. It's just inventory space. One dollar? Jeez. Alright, yeah, I can buy the red ribbon for Paula. Clip here, yes. Thirty-nine forty-four. Yeah, sell that. All right, I can also sell the cheap bracelet because Jeff has the silver bracelet now. All right, I'm also gonna sell the pop gun because Jeff has the toy air gun. Five dollars. Yeah, get rid of that. All right, I'm also gonna buy the great charm for Jeff. Yeah, equip it. Because he didn't have anything. And I... Oh, I'm, I'm spending so much money here. Dang. Hang on. Alright, the silver bracelet for Ness. Alright, I don't need to buy anything else. You know what? I'm good. I've spent so much money here. 
is ridiculous. All right, and I believe that's all we can do in Saturn Valley for now. Oh, there's a guy over here. Let's talk to him. Lots of friends. Taking behind falls. Why? Why, Boing? Well, uh, I don't know. But it looks like we'll have to find out why. So, uh, let's go investigating. Is this the way? No, this is a dead end. <laughs> so, yeah, Saturn Valley is a very strange place. So, uh, there, there was a place to go that was past the cave to get here. That's where we need to go. <laughs> And we're through the cave. So, uh, yeah, just past here is, should be the waterfall. And also got alligators, apparently, and zombies. Farm zombies, to be exact. Oh, hey, they despawned. Cool. All right, uh, oh. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say, Fuzzy Pickles. Fuzzy Pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Okay. <laughs> All right, so we need to come over here. Say the password. Password. So now we have to wait here. Three minutes in actual time. Man, three minutes. What am I going to do for th with three minutes? Like, I I have no clue. So, yeah, you have to sit here without doing anything for three whole minutes. Hmm. I just have no words to say about three minutes. I mean, skip past this whole thing. I might not. Maybe I'll pass forward. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Although, although... That still gives me the question of what I'm going to do for three minutes while I wait for this whole thing to go down. I mean, like, jeez. All right, so this whole thing is, like, it's weird, it's quirky, it's it's kind of bad game design, really. <laughs> like, making the, the player wait for three minutes without having to do anything? I mean, I guess they could just get up, go stretch their legs, go get a glass of water. I don't know, but... And if I want to play a video game, I want to play a video game. I don't want to just sit here for three whole minutes. I mean, this is the perfect opportunity to just go stretch your legs, go get a glass of water, go get a snack. Brush your teeth, I don't know. <laughs> Hey, game. Are you gonna let me play you? Can I move yet? Okay, you may enter. Finally. Three minutes, though. Good lord. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, this is Belch's factory. That's... That's an enemy right there. Yeah, I should be able to take this place on. Did you bring some fly, honey? It's Master Belch's favorite. Mm-hmm. Okay, you may pass through. Hey, be careful. Be sure not to drop it. Okay. I guess you're not gonna battle? You're gonna follow me, though. That's not great. Oh! Those guys will battle, though. Foppy. They're just called Foppy. <laughs> So yeah, this is a quirky game, if you haven't noticed. Like, making you have to wait behind a waterfall for three whole IRL minutes without doing anything, and also Mr. Saturns and these things. So this is the perfect episode to showcase how weird this game can get. Wait, button! Yo, Paula leveled up. And realize the power of Offense Up Alpha. Ooh, that could be really good. Yo. Can't wait. To use it. Oh, God! Zombies. There are four of them. Good lord. Okay. Uh, 
Time to use this. And also, fire on the back row. And I guess shoot that one. No! No, Ness! Oh, you couldn't attack soon enough. Okay, I didn't even... I only knocked out one of them. Dang it! I'll have to go back to Saturn Valley to heal Paula. Dang it! At least I know now not to jump into this room. There's an item in here. I'll grab it quick, though. Oh, hey! Ness leveled up. And realized the power of healing Beta. Hopefully, hopefully that can heal a lot of stuff. What's this? Bomb? Yo. <laughs> okay. okay. I need to go heal though. Oh, dang it. Oh, hey. Jeff leveled up. Too bad Paula's not getting any of this experience. Dang it. Yeah, I brought it. Don't don't be getting in my way again, please. You never give up, do you? Uh-oh. If you don't mind taking it, it in the shorts, go on in. Oh. You mean, like, get my butt whooped? Yeah, well, I, I kind of got my butt whooped last time. Okay, what do I... What happens if I say no? And why are you here? Oh, great, I get into a battle. I mean, it's not like slimy little pile. It's not like, uh, I didn't expect that anyways, but still. Uh, let's have you use freeze. And then you can just shoot. Great, crying. Now I'm gonna miss cool uh speaking of cool stuff oh hey i beat you okay i believe this gets healed after the battle yeah holy that's a lot of foppies let's despawn them yeah that's less of them i guess Oh, that is so many foppies. I'm so glad they can't climb up ladders. Yo, PSI Caramel. Yes. Alright, so there are things in this place. Like Mr. Saturn's. Oh, they have them chained up. That's awful. No problem. What do you mean, no problem here, Ness? Good lord, they have the the Mr. Saturns chained up doing whatever it is they're doing. That's awful. No problem here, my butt. Jeez. What do you say? Erp. It's hard to make the gross sounds that Miss Master Belch does. I know I can't do it. Then don't try to? Master Belch is the slimiest. However, I heard he's also serving some Gygus guy. I, that I cannot believe. I can. Man, this Master Belch sounds like gross dude. Also, I'm glad they don't want to fight us. Oh, there are so many of these foppies everywhere. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to have to cut it here and do the rest of this place next episode. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for more Earthbound when we take down this factory. See you later.